Hi guys, Big Brother Niger is back for its fourth season with Big Brother Niger Pepper Dem. It's showing on DSTV channel 198 and on Go TV channel 29. My name is Eniola Tito for UluriSupergirl.com. I'm at the coffee club in Lekki Phase 1 and I'm not here alone. I'm joined by the second evicted housemate from the Big Brother Niger Pepper Dem house. The talented, jovial, saucy, Pepe Dem, Isilomo. Hey. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you doing? And the crowd goes wild. The crowd goes wild for real. I'm fine. I'm Guys, fine. Guys, the TV screen does not do this woman justice. She's Aww, stunning. Thank you. you thank awesome. You. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Awesome. Great. Great for. Um, thanks for being here, Isilomo. Mm -hmm. Now we're going to talk about your time in the Big Brother house, okay. no doubt. Mm -hmm. But. We have wings in front of us. We got you food. I hope you brought I your appetite. It. I have a very big appetite. <laughs> I'm very hungry. And DSTV did give us a box of um, spices, pepper spices, right? So you're going to close your eyes and you're okay. going to pick one and that's what you use to eat your wings. What if I don't like it? Hey, you live with the consequences. <laughs> <laughs> Such is life. All right, let's, let's have it. Okay, so are your eyes closed? Yes. Okay, so um, put your hand on the box. Here we go, here we go. Let me lift it up. All right, so pick one. Can There's I feel several. around? You can feel around. There are big ones, there are small ones. There are green ones, there are red ones. You want that small one? Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay, this is one of my favorite. Okay, what's, what's it? What is Tabasco it? green pepper sauce. Okay. I like Tabasco. Is it, so is it typically hot? There it is. The red one is typically quite, quite, it's tangy. It's a mm. bit hot. I've never tried this one before. before. Okay. So it'll be interesting to see what it's like. Mm -hmm. Now, let me just quickly open this. How many wigs did you carry with you into the Big Brother house? I had exactly three. <laughs> exactly three? Only? Exactly three wigs. It felt like there were more. <laughs> you know, I felt that I dress a certain way. If, mm. if you check, it could be incredibly girly mm. or it could be incredibly camp. And on the days mm. of the camp, the wig didn't just work. Mm. And then the days I wanted to be girly, the wig worked. Mm. So... You have to keep it fresh now. Yeah, yeah. You have to keep and people... You did that. Keep yeah. it guessing and excited. Yeah, keep people yeah. guessing and excited. <laughs> and, I, and I think Nigeria has responded well to it. From auditioning for Big Brother and actually going into the house, yeah. what was the entire experience like? You know, going to the audition, seeing all those people, the multitude of human beings, and then being selected, and then walking into the Big Brother house. What was it all like? It was very interesting. It was a lot of waiting mm. and waiting. Mm and waiting and waiting <laughs> they kept us on our toes the audition day was very overwhelming mm -hmm. I, I keep telling people on the first day i was pepper sprayed wow and almost slugged wow. a bouncer in the face but um yeah i was i was like ah, what to make them pick you see all these girls with my head big bum bum i'm like ah, <laughs> what you ah. you know um but god was faithful i made it it mm. was it was it was a good it was good mm. from from the audition i think i think the only time i was actually nervous about being on the show was mm. literally before we walked on stage mm. and then i was like oh shit oh god oh god what's going on but after you know, after that mm. i kind of eased into it okay let me put some sauce on your wings thank you mm. So, or rather, let me hold the place and then you put the, okay. as much sauce as you want. Okay. Be it on your wings or on the side. Don't put it on the side. You won't mind if I join you, right? No, I will not mind. Okay. This Tabasco sauce. I'm hoping that I will not die. It's not that hot. I, <laughs> you I are really like laying it on. I like spice. <laughs> you so, really it thick. Okay, you like spice. I do like spice. Cool. Did you do a lot of cooking in the house? Oh, I did. I was mm. the first person to cook Oh, in the really? House. Okay. Yeah, I was the first person to cook Are in you the ready? House. Are you good yes, to go? Or? I'm going to take one. Okay, there you go. Mm, yeah. Okay. Okay. You're the first person to cook in the house. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Talking about that, did you have a strategy in the house? You know, people go into the Big Brother house, you know, um, they say, oh, I'm going to be myself, or I'm going to form an alliance, or I'm going to get into a relationship. Some people, they, they feel like cooking and cleaning will keep them in the house. Mm -hmm. Did you have a strategy? Absolutely not. Mm. Um, for me, it was just important to live my truth and speak my truth. And mm. I don't know if that would be really necessarily called a strategy. Mm. But it was just important for me to be honest mm. and not be two-faced. And I don't know if I had stayed longer in the game, if I would have needed to be two-faced. But as for that first week, it wasn't in the plan. It wasn't in the cards for me. I don't think I know how to be that person. Mm. Which is why I always wondered if I'd actually win. Mm. Because I know you would need to... And I just, I'm not that weaselly kind, kind. you yeah. know? So it would have been incredibly difficult for me to do. Right. But yeah. Do you think there's some people in the house who are, you know, playing the game and doing the whole strategy thing? Oh yes, very much mm. so. I'm playing good games, I must say. Mm. Very good games. 
<laughs> oh, well, who, like who? Who do you think was playing or is playing the game? Jeff is playing the game. Okay. <laughs> um, Kim is playing the game. Kim Oprah, all right. Mm -hmm. Shola is playing his game. Mm -hmm. Shay? Shay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Shay is playing the game. Mm. The girls, I don't know, because mm. sometimes the girls seem a bit distracted to mm. me. Mm. Um, Apart from, I, I am sorry, Tasha is playing the game. <laughs> well, that well, is yeah. my, yeah. Mm. Tasha is playing the game. But the other girls seem a little distracted. distracted yeah. A little fun is always necessary, obviously, for but entertainment. At the same but time. it almost seems like the, the ball is being, the eyes on the ball, ball yeah, being, missing, is being yeah. missed. But yeah. That's a concern I particularly have with Diane. I'm not going to go into it too mm -hmm. much, but, you know, um, just. Recently, Nelson was and uh, Toyo, who are uh, two of her supposed love interests, were like, she needs to get her head in the game. She's 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 taking the whole relationship thing, or you know, looking for love, the love element, a bit too far. What if that's her strategy, though, to hey. get in their heads and their make heads. them think all that? Right. Hey, it's what if, possible. What, what, what if that's it? It's possible. But I do get what you're saying. Mm. I do get what you're saying. What were some of your fondest moments in the house? Um, because there were a lot. There, there were a lot. <laughs> I tell you what, the day I did Nelson's makeup. Nah, <laughs> that was the day you guys couldn't talk, right? That was the day we couldn't talk. <laughs> and that day, a bunch of fantastic things happened. You see, everybody in that house is so incredibly smart. We came up with games in silence, came up with the rules in silence, and everyone the penalties knew penalties in what, silence, the punishments. And mm -hmm. everyone knew what everything was. It was... I'm sure Nigerians were thoroughly entertained that day. I watched that day. Mm -hmm. It's like we're all big children. Imagine grown men and women shooting bottles with rubber bands. Nah, it nah. was beyond Playing me. Playing bowling with plastic balls. You know. Tossing the, the beanbag around. Yeah. And anyone that misses it the, has to go and do push-ups. Do push-ups or squats. And it was, it, was, it was nice. It was a nice day. Um, secondly, for me, would have been the party day. That was a really mm. good day. Mm. Um... Yeah, those were, those were a couple of moments that really stood out for me. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Who do you think, because we've named a few names, mm -hmm. and people are really playing the game. People are, seem to be doing well. Everyone online seems to think Omashala is doing really well. Yes. You know, and I think you said when you got on stage that, you know, you told Ibuka that, you know, if he wins, you'd be cool with mm -hmm, that. Mm -hmm. So my question now is, there are two things. Who would you like to win Big Brother, and who do you think will win Big Brother? Oh, that's a tough one. <laughs> I would like for Tasha to win Big Brother, and I think Tasha would win Big Brother. Why? <laughs> you do know, you're following what is going on on, yes, on social media with Tasha, right? that's just what people like. Okay. That's what people like. And I know Nigerians like real people, and she's mm. real, and she's entertaining. Mm. She might not, I, Tasha might not even mean all these things she's doing. She mm. just wants to keep you entertained. Mm. She came into the game Obviously, knowing the plan she had, mm -hmm. and she has she had not, a strategy. Yes, yeah, she, she strategy. has not wavered from it. Mm. She was incredibly real, and you have to respect a person that is real, even though you don't like what they are doing. At least they let you know, mm. which was why it seemed like I got into a couple of things in the house at first because for me it was important to shut any rubbish down, down. the first time it happened <laughs> let it not repeat itself again mm. so i respected that in her i know people have their opinions but mm. i personally would like her to win if yeah i would like her to, to win, win. yeah okay. i would i really would in the early days you know you and fraud you know seem to be getting Why are you forcing fraud on me <laughs> you know, yeah, yeah the one that was I, I wasn't that, that was cool thing. with him no, you, clear the you got, mm. okay you are listening <laughs> mm? Okay. Which camera? Okay. <laughs> Which camera? Fred and I shared a bed. Okay, guys. Mm -hmm. It's been a couple of months, so I did enjoy a little cuddle. Mm. Okay, guys. Actually, it wasn't a cuddle. It was like two days of cuddle, <laughs> and it was nice. But that doesn't mean anything personally. We're not saying it meant anything. We're just, mm. I just want to know what happened because what I, I, I got to know him and then I found out he was quite yeah, irritating. Nah. Wow. Okay. Okay. That For happens. For me personally. Yeah, that happens. For me. Mm. Now, that's not to say we still didn't have our moments even when I, he started to annoy me because I remember the day I left, he was letting us uh, know stories about his relationships and stuff and I'm mm -hmm. like, oh, wow. This guy is incredibly emotional and... Mm. This girl really played him and mm -hmm. I went to meet with him and I spoke to him about how maybe I feel like he, he feels like his emotions are not very valid. And he said, yes. And I said, but your emotions are important too. So mm. we've had those moments. Mm. But overall, it 
this is me. <laughs> but you guys are just yeah, cool. You're just friends. I, now, yeah, right? I think now we're, we're cool. Like for me, if you notice me, I don't keep the malice. I do the thing yeah, and that's the end. The next on. day, yeah. I will, next yeah. two minutes, I'm, I'm coming to you. Mm. So I move on. It's mm. not that deep. He didn't do anything to me personally. Right. It's just a difference of opinion. They're like, you know, that's mm. it, really. Yeah, that's how it There's works no sometimes. reason why we can't just be friends and, and you know, move you know, on. Move on. Yeah. You know, no, there's no reason why I can't do It's that. all good. The night of the party, you were turned, everyone was, you guys enjoyed yourselves yeah. thoroughly. Uh -huh. But that night, right, you got a bit emotional when Mashallah yes. was going, yeah, you know, bananas crazy. and whatnot, and, yes. you know, shaking to console you yeah. and whatnot. What, what was that about? What was going through your mind? I, you know? Oh, mate, I think that day was like a culmination of the week. Mm. I'm not very emotional, right? Or I am emotional, but I present my emotions in a very different way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It was no secret that I had, I don't want to say likeness, I felt a certain way about Omashola. So I was quite upset that his coins were missing. Mm. And then further to that, the emotions in the house were high, was high. High, very. And it was very night, tense. tight and hot and mm. tense and it was too much for mm. me to comprehend. Mm. I'm not used to being around all that kind of tension gym, and anger. And Do you understand? Right. You know, I, it was just like, oh my God, guys, mm. can we count down? down and just have fun. Because you guys had just come just from like, a I was awesome still party. Buzzing, buzzing, you know. Yeah, you were in the jacuzzi. I was in the jacuzzi. Next thing you know, you know shouting and shouting. slamming things. And yeah, because I mean, even that day, he hit me in the elbow. He slammed the door in my hand. Aww. So it was like, you know, I'm happy that he did eventually listen to me and calm down. But, mm. you know, it could have ended up a bit worse and he would have really regretted it. Which mm. is why I'm happy he calmed down. So that was the reason why I was crying. It was just overwhelming. Right. It was overwhelming. Right. Mm. It was, right. the, being in the house is very emotional, guys. You don't even know. Especially with this group, I have never seen a group of strangers take to telling each other their life so quickly. People were, people were real with the stories. Yeah. People were real with the emotions. It was real. Yeah. I'm sure there were some things they didn't show you guys, yeah. but some things were, were real. Yeah. You know, and it was it was it was nice to watch. Mm. It was it was nice to be part of that. Yeah. I think I came out and saw a post that I'm the human onion, <laughs> and because I got certain people to cry. But no, I think I'm, it's from mm. working in HR. HR, yeah. You're used to listening. Person, yeah. Just tell me what's going on. Yeah. I'll help you. And I thank every housemate that trusted me enough to give me that information. Mm. I regret that I wasn't comfortable or or. Being a or, custodian of all that no, information? No, no, no. I, I feel like I, I, I apologize that I wasn't comfortable or secure enough to at least give back those same emotions right. to those people. Mm. Except for two. I think with Mike, I had a real, real, heart -heart. real heart-to-heart. -heart. And Avala, mm. I had a real heart-to-heart -heart with her as well because we see eye-to-eye -eye on so many issues. But... Um, yeah, mm. it was it, it was really emotional. Mm. It, it may, and, and, and even further to that... When you hear people's stories and people's realities, it forces you to think and reflect mm -hmm. on yourself. Mm -hmm. And you may have to have conversations that you really don't want to have with yourself, especially since it's so quiet. Mm -hmm. You'll be forced to have those conversations. So everybody was really emotionally vulnerable, mm -hmm. I think. Mm -hmm. People presented it in different ways. A moment that you had that I really liked, I think it was on Wednesday when you guys had the Big Brother task and you and Mercy were in the head of house room. Mm -hmm. And, you know, you told her that you had judged her based on her look. Yes. And you were very pleasantly surprised that she's a totally different yes. person from yeah. how you thought she'd be. Yes, yes. You know, and I, 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 cause I felt the same way about Mercy. Yes, yes. But she's such a sweet girl. So different. She's, she's so, so different, incredibly yeah. naive even. Mm. You would think that with a, a body like, like that, that her eye don't tear. You reach back. Not really. <laughs> I, except she's not letting us see it. I really didn't get that vibe mm. from her. I really mm. didn't. Yeah. Even after coming out, seeing that she said, that I irritated her first. I irritated a lot of people at first. <laughs> so I didn't even pick offense in that. Mm. Once you get to know me, you get to love me, hopefully. So yeah, I really like Mercy. I really hope she stays this week. Mm. I really do wish that from the bottom of my heart. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Mm -hmm. So my question to you now is, how do you feel, you know, I mean, it's a game and all that, but how do you feel about leaving the house the way you left the house? Um, I think I'm still a bit upset by it. I think it wasn't fair. I think... Like you said, rightly so, I should have given, been given a chance 
So yeah, I was I was sad. I was really disappointed. I felt like I let my family down. No. I felt like I let specifically my sister down, Danny boy. I feel like I let her down. I was even you know, even now friends are calling me <laughs> and I don't want to pick. Mm. I pick the calls of people that are not that close to me because the, the, mm. the calls of people that are close to me will I hurt me. Yeah. I don't I felt like I let them down. Mm. But you know, after being angry the first night, thankfully mm. I wasn't alone. I had Avala, who yeah. has been an amazing support, support system mm. so far. Um, so it was it was nice. It was mm. it was easier to to handle. To handle. It is still easier to handle because she's with me. So now that it's over, you know what what um what are you going to get into? Because I do remember I was in the live audience, like I mm -hmm. said, mm -hmm. and you did tell Ibuka that <laughs> you're not going back to HR. You're going to no, pursue. Acting, I mean, yeah, what, what, so please like, elaborate on that. <laughs> oh, yeah, definitely. I'm not going back to HR. While I did love it, mm -hmm. I think if I didn't work in corporate Nigeria and abroad, mm -hmm. I would be incredibly naive about the way the world works. Right. So I'm very happy for the experience. Mm -hmm. But it's media, man. What, acting, That's what acting, mm -hmm. radio, mm -hmm. okay. um, TV, okay. in commercials, billboards. Everything media. Everything. Are you going to do something with the whole wig pulling? Definitely, thing? because that has become a thing. A thing. Oh, definitely. I'm going to capitalize on that. Give me, give me a day or two oh, when two. I settle down. Um, mm -hmm. The wig pulling thing. Honestly, I mm -hmm. really don't care about the way I look or I appear to people. I like to look put together, mm -hmm. but I really don't care to follow the traditional lines of beauty. So when I want to wear my wig, I'll wear my wig. And when I don't want to, I'll, I'll take yeah. it off in front of anybody. <laughs> you know? Because um, it's not that big a deal to it me. It isn't. And I think it's my way of letting people know that I'm open. You know? Okay. Yeah. Awesome. Number one is, who are you voting for? This time? Yeah. Okay, for this week, I'm, I'm, I've, I've, I'm voting for Mercy to stay. I voted for her already. I have. If you're given another chance to go back into the house, what would you do differently? I wouldn't do anything differently, but <laughs> from the next day, I go to enter everybody. <laughs> there will be no... <laughs> no. It's not like there was any of that before, but knowing what I do now, everybody's going to get it. Awesome. So someone here is saying, Isilomo, I love your energy. It is out of the Oh, thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you. I didn't have everything I said with Big Brother. Like, when the same way people that asked me who was irritating me and I said it's fraud, it's the same way I've told you people. The same way people that asked me who was fake. You see, it's black and white here. Oh, mm. There's no gray area. Mm. The same way. You will ask me why I thought it was fake, and I said it to people, and I the same way I'm going to say it for you for now. So there's no secret gist, nothing, nothing like, no special gist. Okay. Siloma, so I know how you feel about certain housemates, but mm -hmm. I don't know how you feel about some other housemates. So we're going to play a quick game, right? Mm -hmm. I'm going to call the name of your former housemates, and then in one word, or maximum two, describe that housemate. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Okay. Thelma. Funny. <laughs> Funny. Sir D. Intelligent. Kathy. Kathy from London, the police officer. It's more than one word. It's more than two words. She has a beautiful soul. Hmm. That's what I think. Okay. Yeah. Beautiful soul. Yeah. Mike. Oh. <laughs> Charming. Okay. Yeah. Jackie. Pass. <laughs> Fraud. Pass. Okay. <laughs> Diane. Naive. Mm. Yeah. Toyo. Boring. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Tacha. Fire. Mm. Pepper dead. <laughs> the original Pepper Original. <laughs> she. Sweetheart. Oh, Mercy. Sweetheart. Oh. The body. <laughs> Ike. Oh, Igwe Tupac. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> oh my God, Esther. Uh, <laughs> Pass. I really, wow. yeah, pass. I don't pass. I don't. Why? Did she not make an impression? You no. Know, oh. I thought she kind of hid under mm. opinion. She never really expressed herself. Expressed herself. herself. I, I wasn't really sure about her. I don't think okay. she was fake or anything, but I just wasn't sure. Okay. Mm. Hmm. Nelson. 
big kid, big baby, <laughs> big kid. Kimopra. Pass. Wow. <laughs> Pass. Oh, mashallah. Real. Mm. Real. Okay. Very real. Ella. Ha. Pass. Oh, Jeff. Sick. Wow. Sick, sick, sick. <laughs> sick. Okay. Gedoni. Fine boy. Okay. <laughs> Last but not least, the lovely Avala. Oh, sweetheart. Oh. Sweetheart. Sweetheart. Yes, sweetheart. Yes, Loma, thank you so much. This has been thank awesome. You for me. We wish you all the best with the you know, thank with all you. your future thank endeavors. You so much. And we will keep an eye on you. Thank you. Please keep an eye on awesome. me. Um you can feel free to follow me on all my social media okay. at King Isi Loma on Instagram and Snapchat and at King underscore Isi on Twitter. Awesome. Your numbers have been growing by the way. When you yes. went into the house, you were on yeah, 2005. It was followers. 900. It was not to 200. Why are you giving me? Why are you giving me? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, give me extra. Don't give me extra. It was like 900. 900. Now you're on like 11,000, 12,000. It's 20s. Just what? got past 20k today. What? Yeah. Congratulations. Why are you people following me? Uh, uh, you're awesome. It's 21,700. You guys, what do you see? I can't keep up. Yes. Slova, thank you so much. Thank you for All having me on Lori Supergirl. It's been fantastic. It's been fantastic. <laughs> Remember guys, you can watch Big Brother Naija on DSTV channel 198 and on Go TV channel 29. Remember to follow all the updates, breaking news, everything going on in the Big Brother house on olorisupergirl.com as well, as well as all our social media platforms. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Hi everyone. My name is Itzilomo, ex Big Brother housemate. Please keep it locked to Olori Supergirl.